Hello there everyone and thank you for joining me here this the start of a new campaign in Old World Blues A to Z series which we're playing as MODOK. Now unfortunately, they have a generic focus tree but we're led by Mayor Joe. Once a man you could best describe as perfectly average and voted into office because nobody else wanted to. Joe had to drastically change his attitude towards his position after the trade agreement with the nearby slags helped MODOK through a drought that almost led to its downfall. The following years, the cooperation between the two groups made the farming business in the area flourish, leading to Modoc supplying a lot of nearby settlements with food and other goods. Let's put it on the map for various caravan companies, making the one sleepy town into a popular stop on the big circle route between trading hubs and the NCR and destinations for the east like Vault City. Nowadays, there ain't a single day without a caravan entering or leaving the town. And while Joe used to be a trader, sheriff, mayor, and whatever else was needed, he's now very comfortable as his position of just a mayor. There are finally enough people willing to do the other jobs. But some unique things such as the breadbasket of Nevada, pretty good. We have a work trading hub. And the legacy of the chosen one. Modoc and Slags always support each other in the case of outside aggression. The help of the chosen one made long standing allies out of what could have been bitter enemies. There's nothing that would break the bonds forged three decades ago, but as you can see, we're at war with the Vault City and we are struggling. But they also went to war with the Jackals too, or Jackals could have worn them, so at this point we are struggle busting real hard. Um You know what? You go up here too. So we're going to do whatever we can, hopefully break through, um, and uh, yeah, hopefully we can break through here, maybe, maybe not, good, good, uh, good. Combine them, we need that extra manpower and whatnot, well it's not extra manpower, but whatever, establish an armory, that'd be nice. Um, we're using Old World Blues, Old World Blues Radio, Old World Blues Generic Decisions, and Old World Blues Technology Expansion, I think. And Oral Blues for the little guys. Give us a little bit more of a boost to our generic focus tree. They love attacking. As you can see, they, they love, love, love attacking. Give us political power. Um, we're going to have to go to... Oh! We've only... The single conscription level. That is going to be a pain in the butt, isn't it? Not ideal. Yeah, they're War of the Jackals. And they're actually doing okay against them. Um, they're actually pushed in against them, too. But they're also attacking us. And hopefully they're losing a lot of manpower. Oh! Oh, Gordon of Gecko, I see. Yeah, they still have a thousand manpower. That is not ideal. So we're going to go this way and try to get as much manpower as possible as we establish an armory. Um, explore police stations? Uh, sure. As long as we can hold it first, that's the most important thing. We're going to get a sniper for this group. And for you... Um, you don't have on you, do you? No, you don't. Rudy might not be bad. We might use enforcers later on, which is why I want to wait first. Attack and defense. Hmm. We can use this now, Rudy. You know, it gives us a little more defense. Why not? Just helps hold as much as possible because we have no way of getting more manpower, really. Which is god awful. Military sending bonuses would be nice, but we, even then we don't have very much there. Uh, if that's the case, we're going to do this. We do have five research slots, though, which is pretty nice. I was going to attack, but they kept attacking us. And our divisions aren't terrible, actually. Enforcers, they're up to 18 combat width. Could be better. Uh, we're going to go through that on that. But we have uh, demo teams, fire teams, spec ops looking okay. They're only 10 combat width, though. I would like to throw on some demo teams. I would like to throw on some anti-tank. And whatnot, and getting those chemical companies are going to be very, very, very muy importante. Produce consumer goods, not a bad idea. Can we get manpower this way? Probably not. Not really. And we have the followers here too. So, all right. So Vault City is one, which is not ideal, but we're going to keep continuing on and see if we can beat these guys up. Um, well, with us, people's militia. Hmm. Maybe a man a gun. Yeah, more population which we could use. Constitutional monarchy? No, we're not really a monarchy. Constitutional republic? That's not bad. More political power is always nice. Unlimited democracy. Well, I think people's militia. We were shaped through war and people were united with it. Now we're all sharing a military experience for the benefit of society. Now we're getting more bonuses to militia, but we're not gonna use that. We're really here for the two percent uh, recruitable population. So we're gonna keep going down this way and Keep struggling as, well, we're just trying to survive. Well, I guess, welcome back, everybody. I mean, I guess you guys have never left. I did. It's 2288, or 2280, I guess. The NCR and Legion are killing each other, but the Legion look like they're doing well. Uh, New Reno died, uh, taken out by both Klamath and the Protector Security Hub, and we're war with Slanter. We're justifying now in the 80s, 
And the Guardians have a war goal against us, so... I hope they come attack us. I really do. I'd love to attack them. Uh, if you're going to lose, just kind of hang out. And hopefully we can win down here. Um, I do want to go to War of the Ages because this is a nice little area where we can maybe bait them into attacking us. That sounds pretty good to me. Um, but oh, look at that air power. Of course, we are doing some uh, uh, ground operations with our fighters only. We've researched a whole lot of stuff here between the fade and fade out and whatnot. I mean, you kind of have to. Modoc's not a very strong city, not going to lie to you about that. I'll lie to you. It's not about that, maybe. Uh, and, oh, and, see, I knew it happened. The Guardians had declared war upon us. Here we go. You know what? If they can destroy Klamath, I'm kind of okay with that. I don't mind getting technically a free territory, especially one that we can't really get if they're in our way. Um, so, just go and do this. Let them, because the Guardians want to kill them, everyone off. How strong are they? Up to 56 divisions. Klamath is definitely not nearly as strong. Uh, broken Mask, Recon Kids, yes. Uh, we have five research slots, which is pretty nice, but working on getting a sixth one as well, which is also quite good um, with uh, this stuff here, so. You know what, we can go and do that, that's fine. Um, anything else? We'll probe them from here and there. If they start beating us up a little bit, we're going to really start attacking them really hard then. Um, but we got money, which is nice. We've got you know, the means to do well. Ooh, they're attacking us as well. Oh, that's not ideal. Oh, the Brotherhood there, huh? Uh, you know what? They want to attack us? That's fine. They destroy the Klamath Divisions, and that'll make us maybe better or stronger, perhaps? I mean, our divisions are pretty, pretty nice. Enforcers. Oh, uh, we need to throw someone else on here. Probably recon. We're using riders right now for uh, suppression bonuses and whatnot. And there you go. Ah, there's that six research slot. Very good. Um, let's go to recon. Why not? I mean, I went with six just because we need. We have nothing. We don't have very much. Not a lot of population, which now we do. In the beginning, we didn't. Uh, but just to give us some sort of advantage so we can catch up to everyone else. Optimize trading, sure, why not? Hunting on the move, that's fine. Uh, or hunting on the river, recovering pre war holes, that's okay. Oh. Oh. So if that guy is going to take these guys out, that'd be great. This does open up a gigantic border between us and them, unfortunately. Um, I don't like that they're taking the burrows, though. Can you please attack him here? You know what? Let them all save. Let's attack. And see what happens. Uh, okay, so now we're caught in a really bad area. Is mini nukes? I think we're going to need some mini nukes. Uh, go with that many. Go down to this many. That'll be fine. So, the bad uh, Thunderbirds. We don't technically have a border with them. Help everyone possible. The Den and Nevada Free States. They want basically Vault City. Well, hopefully the Thunderbirds don't win. If they do, we got some problems here. Mm. Well, what's going on with this war? So. We've lost 2,000, mostly against Klamath, but we're rapidly catching up because we're on a time constraint here because the Thunderbirds look like they're coming to move on in. Not ideal. Uh, how much manpower do the Guardians have? Not that much left. And the Klamath does basically is in the same boat as them. But we're looking okay. Corvault City, you're looking all right. Scavenger's Triumph, that's good. Uh huh. Good, 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 good. See what we can do. Um, kind of the box, yes. Medivac, that's good. Keep helping out with all this stuff here too. It's all good stuff. They're not expanding up here too much. Cutting them off would prove to be a better idea than anything else you could do right now. Of course, they do have some advanced, not advanced power armor, but they got some really good power armor. Um, here, do that. For now. Yeah, what is that? There's heavy ships, open seas, better planes. 
more divisions. There's putting up there, but these guys are cut off, which is nice. Uh, finish that stuff off. Thunderbirds are actually getting the crap bean out of them, which is actually kind of nice. I did want to go to War of the 80s, though. So, there is that. We're out of portable radios. That's pretty normal. Recon. Why not? Ah. There's a justification for them. Well, it doesn't look like we can really use it right now, but whatever. We'll get there in time. That should help us win the war pretty quickly. This is getting disgusting. So I need the special forces to come up here and get the crap out of them this way. And you guys help hold the main line here. I need y'all not to collapse on yourselves. So there you go. Go 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 go. Um, can we get any more air buffs, perhaps? Lightning raids? Sure. Not like it's a huge buff, but whatever. Where are you guys at? Come on. Lightning air reports. And we're done with our focus tree already. Go figure. Yeah, Thunderbirds died. Wow, that's kind of fast. So surprising, not gonna lie. Quite surprising, really. <coughs> but yeah, we cored all the Vault City area, which is pretty nice. Um, I recommend you go here. If you do that, you might be able to encircle them. Probably not, but maybe at least one division would be nice. Like you just did here. Fantastic. And you encircle someone else. Work smarter, not harder. I go here. There we go. Dang it. Ah, oh, I thought we'd be able to circle somebody. Guess not. Keep these guys in their place. Uh, can you go here? And then you guys can go here? Probably not, but we'll see. Eh, maybe they're not too strong. Good. Very nice. No, we're not going to pay you. Recon. Nice. It's barely out of time. Alright, and now we'll let everyone else keep going. There we go. Keep it up. We're doing quite well. Yeah, I guess we won't be able to take out Klamath this way. If we want to take out Klamath, we have to fight the NCR too, and I don't want to do that. Unless they're really losing, then I don't care. Special forces are very, very good. So, I mean, it helps if you got gun, you know planes just blazing all over the place, destroying everybody. Good. Ah, we got him. Awesome. Now, will Klamath hate us for that? That's a real question. Because this is god awfully ugly. Jesus Christ. So now we might have fight the 80s. Which is good. Uh, no, I don't get there. Uh huh. Uh huh. I spy. With maybe one of my eyes. A place we could potentially encircle people? Let's see first. They might just want to come and just ram into our lines and eat us up and spit us out that way. So let's wait first. Let's find a cut of losses. Um, more divisions, yes. Infantry divisions, yes. Sounds good to me. Guardian Citadel. I forgot about that. Fort 
locations. Very nice. Nine, huh? It's kind of awesome, actually. My training. I'll go ahead and do that too. It's been army training. Mini nukes, please. Labs. Yes. Yes. Motorize. That one. War support. Uh, good. Good stuff. That's what see you looking. There's a jewel. Level 10. I love it. Wish you come and try to fight us though, but you know, whatever. Can't get everything you want. Lord and survival training. Elite force has hurts a recruitable population factor, but it does help out our non combat support units and special forces with more HP, more armor. So you can complain just a little bit. Nice, good stuff. How much longer must we wait? Eh, we're halfway done, that's not bad. Tons of roads, please. Good. Uh huh. Uh huh. Yeah, I'll definitely want these. Still working on radios. Eh, we'll leave it at five for now. And eh, go up to two. We got one, two, three. Let's go with uh, you here. Part standardization is nice. Very good. Very good. Not bad. Not too shabby if I do show myself. We have no extra planes. At least we still got a decent amount of manpower though. Once you call started calling Vault City's territories, it got better. Ah, uh, sure. Sure. Why not? Yeah, why not? Seems pretty good to me. And what do they do? Push forces attack, eh? Yeah, it's not bad, we'll take it. And we're gonna save. And see what happens. Maybe we'll, they'll come attack us and we'll lose, but I kinda doubt it. Ooh, Kaza's Legion still pushing in, which is good, which allows us to take out other people that we want to take out. So are they gonna push in at us at all, or are they just gonna say, meh? Freedom of movement? I never choose this one. Let's go with that one. No. Ah, see, I knew they would eventually. Good. <coughs> Excuse me. Medical outreach. Um. There you go. Yeah, yeah. We do get an air base here. It's not much, but it's something. Um, I think we'll be able to push the. Oh, you know, as long as they want to continue attacking, I'm kind of okay with just letting them do that. I don't think they're going to reinforce the southern front too much. Could be wrong. Uh, good. Pretty good. So after this, who are we going to take out? Echo Posse? Probably? We're still pretty divided there. Even another trade node? Don't need it. A 480? Oh, maybe not. Ah, uh, War Sports always good. Why not? Alright, so how much have we lost? 700 versus 300? It's not great, not bad. Uh, a lot hard left on everything here. I'll go there too. 2,000 manpower up to 34 divisions, that ain't too shabby. Um, really start. Hello? Pissing him off? Uh, for doing this.
Oh, look at that encirclement. Goodbye. And now go in. And now go in. Just crush them, that's all you have to do. Beautiful. Ah. Of travel way of life. Well, we could, but we don't have to. It's pretty nice. Haven't quite met up with them from down south, but we're working on it. Hey, reduction reduction costs. It's not bad. Oh well, wow. white legs drop walkers all over the place here. Nice. Mm. Go with awareness. They have recon? Yes, I do. Oh, lots of recon then. Common weaponry is pretty good too. And war sports, nice. Good. aren't you? Rabbit redeployment, awesome, and we're done with our land option for now. Uh attack here. I think they're out of manpower, at least strength, because they're they're not looking so good now, are they? I'll go posse. Yeah, there you go. Nice. Yeah, go in. Have fun with it. Why not? NCR is still slowly, slightly losing. worked out pretty much how I wanted it to. Beautiful. Just beautiful. Kaban struts. Uh, no. Very nice. So you guys. You should have one of the main armies here. You should have another one of these main armies here. Of you. Honestly, you don't need a lot of sector territory because a lot of it's not even cord, so it won't really matter too much. Good. No training, money, don't need it. Actually, I should probably shouldn't have chosen that one either. Teachers, industry stuff, sure. Sure. Budget, uh, military setting bonuses, yeah, why not? Pretty good. Boop, 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 boop. Nice. Good stuff. Looking alright. There you go. Makes a few more guns that we don't really need right now, but that's alright. And uh, yeah, we're going to start working on our other stuff. So after this, maybe Badland Buckaroos. Uh, Nevada Free States I'd like to take out as we keep an eye on this war down here. Depending on how much manpower the Kaiser's Legion has left. Which I don't assume very much, yeah. I don't think we can take on the NCR though. We don't have enough divisions for them because they're a gigantic group. 
Why are you going to take them all out? A few well placed attacks. Might speed up as well. Might be all we need. There's only one way that they can get through here, so. Potentially. Now, the help of the Legion out, too. Which I'm not necessarily saying we want to help out the Legion, but. Certainly an option. Good. And how many more days we got? 11. Pretty good. Pretty nice. Right, what else can we core around here? You want? It's kind of expensive, but we'll take it for now. Your recon, nice. So this modifier here too, so what do you expect? Alright, let's do this. They love the green. Engine advancements, very nice. Grenades. Ah, extra factory. So, what are we missing here? Planes. Tons of planes. There you go. Ah, pretty nice. With that in mind, though, we're going to end the episode there. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please consider leaving a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and see you tomorrow. Let's see what else we can do with good old Modoc. Thanks for watching, and see you tomorrow.